Oh, well, it's likely that you've damaged one of the two major blood vessels. Who suited you this? It's almost like a textbook. It was Dr. Baby. All right, um, uh, keep the arm elevated and pressure on the bleeder. And can we have an HB, please? Sarah Pearson, what were you thinking? I was just trying to be helpful, okay? But you weren't asked to suture, were you? Anyway, you missed the vessel. Not harassing our registrar, eh? You know what this is, don't you? This is payback time. She has the guts to take people on. This is what she gets. Elliot is not a racist. Oh. Well, how do you know? Because... Obviously. <laughs> Obvious nothing. How many times has somebody made some smart-ass remark about your race or your color or your size? And you just turn the other cheek because you didn't want to appear to have a chip on your shoulder. This is about other issues, Rick. If this is about Dr. Abebe's competence, then say so. But say so to her face. Otherwise, just keep your snide remarks to yourself. Chief Exec's instructions. She wants your precious whiteboard out of here. <sighs> just about out of the gutful of this place, really. Can you put it back, please? Put it back! Now! Could be colitis. I think we might be looking at Clostridium difficile. It's a bacteria which affects the bowel. There was a case when you were previously admitted on Keller. Can we get a stool culture ESR and CRP, please? If you see this, she needs to be in isolation. Yes, well, we'll keep her down here, if you don't mind, Mr. Durant, until we can move her up to Keller. Right you are, Mr. Griffin. Abra, the whiteboard. I'm sorry. The budget just won't give enough to pay for it. It's not crucial, so... So what is? Night ops? SHOs? What happened with Maddie isn't down to me. So what is your responsibility, then? Excuse me? Well, no whiteboard, no SHOs. Contract cleaning out to the cheapest providers so we get cross-infection. I mean, it's all false economics, isn't it? No. Your focus is getting to see patients fast, right at the expense of what? Infection control? If there's cross-infection, it's down to you. The whiteboard goes. Yeah, me too. Okay, Sarah. We've stopped the bleed, but your hemoglobin's low, as we suspected. One of our nurses will set up a saline drip, and we'll give you some iron tablets to sort it. Okay? Thanks. Um, she is on vancomycin, isn't she? You see, Dick? Uh, yeah, Tandy sorted it. Well, I'm not sure she did, babe, because there's nothing on the chat. Oh, please. I don't speak, really, just don't. And he's useless, Rick's lost it, and the CEO doesn't give a toss. Any ideas? Night hops. Hmm. Hang on in there. Night hops. Sarah Pearson won't let anyone treat us except you. Infection control when I moved the uh, woman with C. diff. Excuse me. Uh, all right, take it up to Keller. Yeah, yeah. What's wrong with the side room here? Jane's not happy. Danger of cross infection. Plus, someone missed giving her vancomycin. Who? Oh. Yes. Look, the patient contracted this thing on Keller, and that's where she needs to be, so let's get her out. Uh, pulse 120, temperature 39, BP 90 over 60. All right, let's get right to ITU straight away. I see there's a vacancy for a GS consultant in Bath. Tempted? Yes. I've just had a call from a Mr. Bond making a complaint and threatening legal action. Um, talk to Dr. Baby. What on earth is going on here today? I'll write you a report, shall I? Add it to the pile on your desk. My budget report, my night ops plans. Yes, about that, there is no way that I can recommend it to the trust, Abra. Not in its present form. I give in. You got me. Lena, I'm thinking Bargies and Biryani. Now what? I want out. Again. It's about the night ups. You go without me because I've, I've only just moved in. I didn't mean. You're going to tell me later, will you? Because you know, I can't go anywhere, not with Max, had you thought? No. No, because you didn't think about me. Got it, nangling, and just going out of my mind here. Frightened and running away and absolutely flipping useless. Abra, you are the most selfish man. Every time something goes wrong, you run. 
I have plans for this department here. Yeah, and it can happen. Yeah, well, I'll light the night. Oh, she won't go with it. Well, that's why you're throwing your toys out the pram, is it? I just want to do the job the way I see it. Oh, then get your hands dirty. Get people on site. You talk to Ricky. He's supposed to be your friend. You know, everything is in you, uh, with you, isn't it? Good intentions are just, they just don't go anywhere. You know, and it's the same with us. Something goes wrong, you run out, but if you want this with me, you better grow up. Start thinking about what I need. Um, bottom line, Tandy's just not suited to AAU. I mean, she can't handle the pressure. It's as simple as that. It's, it's just absurd that we should be at loggerheads about this. Where's this going? What do you want? I need an ally. Um, I had these plans for night ops, and the CEO's not them back. Listen, I mean, the, the theatres are out of commission all night, every night. I, I, I want to bus in people from developing regions and treat them. Money? Charities? I mean, I mean there's money, there's just no facilities. Have you put a budget together? Do you have a surgical team in place? If I don't get this off the ground, I'm going. No budget, no surgical team. <laughs> no wonder Jen Grayson wouldn't back you. Excuse me. I explained to Mr. Bond that C. diff can't really be guarded against. And the complaint? I've persuaded him to drop it. Listen, um, <laughs> it's not a homosexualist thing, okay? I really can't do with this rift between us, all this fighting and falling out. If I'm going to get these night ups off the ground, I'm going to have to think more strategically. Yeah, be a bit more canny, that's what I'm getting from everyone. Go on. Well, it's no secret that I'd rather Tandy wasn't in AAU. Now, if you help me with the night ops and we get it set up, I'll make her part of the surgical team. You'd do that? She'd be under your direct command. I mean, quite frankly, it'd be better than having her flying solo in AAU. Everything would have to be above board. What else? <laughs>